Hi Libra, how are you? This is your um, April tarot reading. I hope you're doing okay. Thanks for liking, thanks for subscribing. And um, yeah, I'm just sending you lots of love and peace really. So we're going to go into the energy. If you've got um, Libra anywhere in your chart, you may resonate. I'm using this lovely deck. <laughs> New deck that I just bought. It's very nice. So let's go into it for you. Libra for um, April. Stability. Set a solid foundation. I like that. <laughs> okay, so solid foundation, very important in any, any sort of relationship or situation in your life. Okay, doing well. <laughs> Right, so you've got here, um, you've got here success, okay? Tara is saying you, you have done very well um, to basically do whatever it is you've done lately, right? And you could be in the process of it right now. Um, Spirit is going to be very pleased with you. Um, and you, you're feeling better. You are feeling better. Now, you're also coming into some acceptance here because... The Empress, the mother of the tarot, knows how to nurture herself and she also knows how to birth things. She's very accepting of whatever it is that comes into fruition through her energy. Okay. And it's a, and she's deeply connected to the high priestess. So there's a spiritual element here as well. Um, it's like something very deep is going on with Libra at the moment, and you're learning to finally accept a situation or a relationship in your life oh gosh gilbert it's okay darling somebody's doing some work down there and he's got it's okay oh bless him um gilbert don't start i can't concentrate right so you've got here right the empress so she's um accepting and this is a situation where something can't come together it can't be harmonized right um, the two ones can't come together as one. And the guy in the middle is actually quite sad. Um, now, um, the bottom of the deck is interesting. You know, you're, you're actually in such a good position. You're in such a good position. I feel the acceptance energy, the maturity of Libra is just growing. And you are aligning so much to spirit. Um, it's a very deep spiritual awakening taking place. And... It means that you're maturing, you're becoming able to embody the acceptance of your life and the way it is and the way certain things don't seem to come together for you. But this acceptance, this kind of maturity spiritually that you've reached, that you are reaching, is setting this very solid foundation within yourself. You, you know, you're much more present. The Empress is very present. Like I said, deep connection to the High Priestess. So there's a deep spiritual element. At the bottom of the deck, you've got the Ace of Cups, which is um, basically like heart chakra, awakening, um, very deep contentment within yourself. And three of ones underneath confirms you're in a very good position. You're in a very good position. So it's quite a strange process because I feel the process you're going through is having to accept something that hasn't worked. And yet by accepting the fact it doesn't work and becoming at peace with it, it's actually giving rise to the fact you're actually in a very good position for love, you know, or something else amazing to happen. You've got somebody here with devil energy and then it's the king of cups. I mean, that is just bizarre. Um, they're going to find the courage. There's somebody here. Oh, my goodness. Right. Okay. This is definitely connected to you. There's somebody here they're thinking of you you've got the empress energy right um this person has devil energy they've got a lot of ego right um i would say attraction to you or addiction problems they've got the king of cups they're being guided by spirit this is beyond their control and they're going to find the courage right that's courage at the bottom of the deck to come forth to you as the empress you're setting the solid foundation by saying, I accept this situation hasn't worked as I wanted it to. 
And then as you do that, you're changing the energy and something amazing is going to happen. Your spirit guides are telling you the age of light. You have been training for this for lifetimes. Amazing. Okay. Sorry if you can hear that work getting done outside. It's a bit distracting. Um, you've been training for this for lifetimes. So this is it. You're finally coming into your power. Boom. Libra, something amazing is happening to you. As we complete March, we've got 21st of March, we've got the new moon in Aries. Apparently, it's going to be epic. <laughs> so this could be where you're really, really transforming into this deep spiritual accepting energy, maturing, all the rest of it. You're just deepening your roots into spirit, into yourself, and finding this love within yourself, finding this contentment in yourself. You are in such a good position I feel there's going to be a situation with somebody who could have been quite toxic in the past coming towards you or you are manifesting somebody who will be a lot more protective. But this has all been leading up in previous lives to what you're doing now. This is no joke. This is you finally burning off so much karma and that's what you came here to do in this lifetime, okay? So it's just quite a deep message, really. Let's pick a card from my deck. <laughs> Um, okay, so they're telling you empty mind equals source, okay? And that is the truth. It's, it's crazy, but when you've got an empty mind, you're in source. And that's what the Empress is. She is so connected to source. It's, that's why she can birth, you know, anything, basically. Um, so stick with that. Stick with that empty mind, you know? Stick with what you're doing because you're going to be birthing something in April, I'm telling you. And it's going to be something you've dreamt of, you know. So that's the message. I'm sending you lots of love and peace. Um, if you want to buy the deck, just contact me. Go to my website, awakeningtarot.co.uk. You can message me on there. Message me your email address and then I'll email you. Um, and um, if you want to book in for a reading, obviously you can do that as well. All my contact details are on the website. Just look at the links below. It's all on there. Um, and I am sending you lots of love, lots of peace, wherever you are on Gaia.